Natalie Euling, and I'm back with my amazing friends at Chameleon Cold Brew. And today, I'm giving you the best recipe that is gonna carry you on through the holiday months, and you're not gonna feel guilty about eating it, because, hello, we're all like, during the holidays, we gotta get that waist looking good, right? So um, with the holidays, there's you know there's tons of treats and ice cream and all these things, and I'm gonna show you guys a recipe called nice ice cream. Um, I'm lactose intolerant. I told you guys that before. So here's an easy, easy recipe that you can swap and just add it on your little pumpkin pie or whatever you want, and it's guilt-free and really good for your body. So let's do this. So you're gonna have a um, first high-speed blender at home. It doesn't have to be a Vitamix. It can be anything that you guys have at home. Use what you have. Um, and then we're gonna, uh, you're gonna take bananas and you're gonna freeze these bad boys in your freezer. You just peel them, put them in, you pop them in your freezer and freeze them. Uh, bananas have huge amounts of potassium. So if you're an athlete or you're very active, these are gonna help with uh, muscle cramps at night so you're not getting any Charlie horses or things like that. Second ingredient is you're gonna have this amazing thing called the coconut. I love coconuts. Um, I love putting them in my smoothies and also in my nice ice cream because they uh, create this amazing creamy texture that's just delicious and honestly no other food um, does it quite as well as, um, as the coconut. Also, the coconut is low in sugar and high in fiber, so that's a good point here. Second ingredient is amazing cinnamon. Yes, during the holidays, it's all about the cinnamon. Uh, cinnamon is high in antioxidants, so it's really good for heart health and something um, that you guys should use and put in a lot of your foods daily. And then the lastly, the star of the show, is our good friends at Chameleon Cold Brew. This is not just a coffee. You can make things with it. You can add it to lots of your ingredients and lots of your recipes at home. So let's do it, right? All right, so first you're gonna take your uh, bananas and they're already frozen, so they look like this and you're just gonna stick them in your high-speed blender as so. If you have a lot of people coming over, more bananas. If you have less, less. Then um, I like to take a teaspoon of cinnamon. It creates that really nutty flavor in the nice cream. And you're just gonna set it in right there. Perfect. And then you're gonna take your bad boy coconut, which I just crushed outside with a hammer. Yes, I did. You're gonna take it, you're gonna scoop out the meat, which is amazing. And um, I've already scooped it out. So you're gonna take a handful of this meat, which is so good. I love to eat it too. Yes, I do. All right, so you're gonna take that meat and you're gonna pull it in there. It's gonna give a creamy texture. Then you're gonna take your lovely cold brew. I like the smoka flavor. It gives it um, kind of a nutty, chocolatey flavor and is just amazing ice cream texture. So you're gonna take this and pour in like a third of a cup right there and seal it up. This is where the magic begins. Put that top on, pull it up and turn on your blender. So I like to keep it pretty low because I like to keep my ice cream like that chunky, you know, uh, texture. All right, done, off. So, pop this off and then I'm gonna show you guys. Amazing. All right, so there's the texture, so delicious. Then you're gonna take a bowl gonna obviously just scoop it out here. So you can see the texture is the same as ice cream, hold on. Jesus, take the wheel. Yes, it is good, my friends, it is good. So you're gonna take this, oh, that coffee flavor, the mocha flavor is my favorite. Just adds that coffee texture to this little delicious treat that is going to be really good for your waistline and really good in, um, in nutrients and vitamins and all that good stuff so you're not feeling sick and bloated after you eat your little treat. After that, to top it off, I love cinnamon. I cannot express the love I have for this, um, this little spice. So taking it, and I like to just sprinkle it on top, as so. There you go. And if you have any extra coconut meat, I just kinda like to sprinkle on the top there. And 
voila. So that's it guys. Um, I just made the most healthy holiday treat for you guys. The holidays are coming up, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Take this recipe, make it your own. Add some serious energy in there and you will be flying high, my friends. So make sure you check out chameleoncoldbrew.com and also my website, natalielingfitness.com for more awesome recipes. And I'll see you guys soon. Enjoy the holidays. Mwah.